Tonight, a guilty plea in court from a Milwaukee County supervisor. Yeah, prosecutors charged Sean Rowland just yesterday with one count of making false statements regarding nomination signatures collected in 2022. 12 News Saria Sandlin was in court as a judge decided his punishment. How do you plead to count one, make false statement, election candidates? Guilty. Less than 24 hours after the state filed charges against him, County Supervisor Sean Rowland pleaded guilty to falsely certifying signatures. Those signatures required for all candidates to be on the ballot in the April 2022 Milwaukee County election. The individual that um, receives the signatures on the nomination paperwork is required to personally certify that they personally received each signature. Investigation revealed that he did not personally observe signatures on, on those four sheets at least some of these signatures. Prosecutors say Roland used an unauthorized drop box in front of his home to collect those signatures. The defense did not deny this. This was also in the midst of the Omicron variant, um, uh, reestablishing concern in the community about um, you know, having close contact with one another. Um, but nevertheless, Mr. Rollin knows that the rules are there for a reason. Roland's attorneys and the state suggested a $500 fine to which the judge agreed. This is not a, uh, a violent offense, um, but yet it does relate to the integrity of our elections. I, I do think that a fine is appropriate in this matter just to send the message that this can't, this will be monitored. After the ruling today at the courthouse, Supervisor Rollin declined to do an interview, but he tweeted a statement saying the best apology anyone can make is to not make the same mistake again. He says he plans to do that moving forward. And I apologize uh, for these mistakes and I agree that I hate being a distraction from all the good work that's happening in Milwaukee County. Roland has six months to pay the fine. In Milwaukee, Cyria Sandlin, WISN 12 News.